Like, Tony's that guy. Like, Tony is really good at writing jokes. Like, his ability to, like, especially joke shitting on people. <laughs> yeah, his brain's constantly working. When you talk to him, he's yeah. not even, he's looking past you thinking how he, what joke he's going to say after. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> He's a machine. Yeah. That's why he's, I mean, your show, fuck, first of all, congratulations, dude. Thanks. I mean, you guys are fucking killing it. It's insane, dude. You guys are killing it. You guys sold out Madison Square Garden two nights in a row. You guys sold out a giant ass theater in LA and you want to do another show. So we'll just do the Staples Center. <laughs> like what? <laughs> you, sell, you sell that out like that. It's bananas. You guys are printing money. It's ridiculous. And it's the best fucking comedy show in the world. It's the best show. Because like you guys, first of all, you guys have been doing it now for 11 years almost. Right? When it'll be 11? Uh, December? June, I think. June? Yeah. <laughs> so it's almost 11 years. So you've been doing it all these times. You gotta, it's polished. You guys are synced up. Everybody knows their position. The band is great. The audience is super aware of how the show works. They're not confused. Like, what's going on? How come he has a minute? And what's him? Everybody knows how it works. And it's just polished. And then you got Tony, who's just locked in. The fucking lines he has, so many people do not believe that he comes up with those on the spot. They're like, oh, that's all planned out. Like, no, none of it's planned out. That's the magic of it. Yeah. Like, especially when him and David go at it. When him and, when David Lucas and Tony Hinchcliffe shit on each other, it's as hard as I ever laugh. There's like compilations of them shitting on each other on YouTube, and in a bunch of them, it's me, like red faced, yep. can't breathe, ah! holding <laughs> holding my sides, just like Jesus Christ. They, it's so funny. It's so good. My, and David's I, gets to just call him gay for like like 15 minutes straight. It's so funny. The show went against every single direction that the industry was trying to, trying to tell us the audience was going. The, your show went against all of the woke shit, against all of the don't say this and don't say that, and this is a forbidden word. Now, all of it's out the window, and it's the best show. And then the audience is obviously responding. There's not a fucking podcast on earth that could sell out arenas like you guys are doing. Not one. You guys are selling out Madison Square Garden in an hour. It's nuts. I mean, it's that's that's like a cultural phenomena. That's a real audience. Like finally, the audience reacts to like this is what we want. This is what we've always wanted. We don't think comedy is real life. We're not fucking stupid. Go crazy. Go crazy, say wild shit. And it's it's the best for comedy, man. It's the Johnny Carson for comics. Mm -hmm. And you don't like it, it's also random. And you, you know, you could be doing comedy ten years or you could be doing comedy your first time and somehow get on Johnny Carson. You, know? you can be doing comedy your first time and get on Johnny Carson at the <laughs> Staples Center. Yeah. Which is the, one of the worst things ever when that happens, it's, by the way. <laughs> well, if you can get through that, though, I mean, good Lord, if you can get through that, what a career you'll have. You'll be able to tell people the first time yeah. he was ever on stage was in front of 20,000 people. And now here he is headlining the Comedy Works in Denver. I mean, that's an amazing thing. That's what Janice did her third time on stage in front at, at uh, the arena here on that's New Year's Eve. Nuts. <laughs> that is so nuts. <laughs> Third time on stage. That is bananas. <laughs> that kind of pressure is bananas. And then, ah! and then after that, I asked her to marry me. Like, she's already like, oh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, that's cute. That's adorable. That's adorable. Yeah, you guys are killing it, man. It's it's awesome to see. It's, it's you, Somebody sent me a clip of an old JRE. Uh, it was like the week we uh, started that uh, Kill Tony. And you're like, what's this new show you're doing or something like that? And I go, oh, it's me and this guy named Tony Hinchcliffe. You know Tony, right? Oh, I think so. I don't know. <laughs> wow. That's crazy. That's crazy. Yeah. I mean, we've been working so hard at it. And we always thought, you know, it's going to become big or, but not, not this big, not having like Post Malone and RFK on the same show. And <laughs> shit. Like what the hell is going on? You remember on the time here? I just, I tricked Post Malone. He had no idea who's going on stage. Oh we yeah. You've done that a few times. You I've did it with, with uh, Tucker Carlson. Tucker Carlson. <laughs> yeah. We just well, be known. If you're a famous person and we're hanging out and it's Monday. <laughs> oh, let's go through this curtain real quick. What the hell? I might, I might drag you out onto the internet. 
Uh, but listen, Tucker Carlson handled it like a champ. He was great. Tucker's hilarious, man. He, he, he was so smooth and so relaxed and so f- genuinely happy and fun. He's just wild. It, you know, having interviewing that guy who says he sucked Obama's dick like that. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> I forgot to ask him about that. <laughs> Remember when William just, or was it William or Cam just brought that yeah, up? Yeah, William brought up, <laughs> that guy really sucked Obama's dick. <laughs> What a nightmare. <laughs> what a nightmare. <laughs> Tucker. Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm so fucking funny. And his brother now works at the mothership and it's like the coolest thing ever. Yeah, it's amazing. <laughs> he, he, William is so funny and he's so confident now. And look, I mean, when we first met that guy, he was awkward, but kind of funny, but he had to have those goddamn notes. Mm-hmm. And how many times did we have conversations with him in the green room? Oh, like millions. Millions. Yeah. Like, dude, you got to ditch those notes. Because when he would do Kill Tony, when he would engage with the audience, I go, when you stare at the audience and start talking to them, I go, it makes me nervous. Like, as a, f- a friend of yours, you're so <laughs> wild that, like, I'm in the audience, like, this guy's crazy. Like, that's better than staring at your notes, right. man. Engage them. Look at them. You can remember your jokes and he just had to like be convinced that he can re- now he's doing an hour on stage with no notes no and killing headlining selling out everywhere dude the black keys specifically wanted to see him when he was in town so i had william come up and do the show i called him i got like dude <laughs> the black keys want to those guys you. are by the way are the coolest guys the best. They're, fucking- <laughs> they're the best <laughs> they're the best they're the- and so is everyone around them yeah we went to see them at their show at Stubbs mm-hmm. and hung out with them and ha- everyone right mm-hmm. so cool yeah and they were just there's william like they were so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> william. they're just giant <laughs> william fans uh, they okay. were so pumped to hang out with him it's funny hearing that like hearing people you know that story tony told you last night about that guy that's a huge casey rocket fan uh, amazing <laughs> yeah. yeah amazing ceo of a big company yeah know, but, ceo you know, of a huge <laughs> company and he's doing a casey rocket impression, impression of crab walk like that is <laughs> insane didn't drake also say something the drake like watches every week uh, i guess <laughs> it's crazy oh, I mean, it's team drake <laughs> when you guys had sugar sean o'malley the u.s ufc bantamweight champion revealing the winner of like one of the battles like yeah. that this is incredible man you got jelly roll oh, yeah. singing in front of arenas for you guys like this is the whole thing is so nuts man 